Hello, this is a nice to know video for the new iOS 16.1 update for creatives. I think um, only two things. Um, here when you search for pictures and you want to download them, I pick and hold the picture and now when I drag it, you see the picture has a checkerboard pattern. In the background it's not transparent okay when I press and hold it and I save it to the photos and I open now the the photos here's a downloaded picture and sometimes it doesn't work at the first time but here Press and hold with your finger or pick it. Okay. Nah, it doesn't work. I think it's... Eh, now, you see? Um, now it works. And this is um, yeah, a cut cut out of the, of the object and when you leave your finger now it's possible to share your object and save it and here you got now your object without a background it's a png with a transparent background and this is really a nice feature uh, because you have to do it uh, in Procreate, for example, manually, or you have a other application for this. But now it works automatically, I think is the word, automatic. Okay, that's the first one. And the next thing is... Um, I need an example. Um, yes, use this one. Here is a, a website you can create um, yes, such nice spaceships. Okay. And when you find you in the right corner, you can download the file and save it. And here in the... files manager or files app you see here it's now possible to change the the settings here and show all the extensions okay and you see this object is now a text file but we don't need a text file. And now when you press and hold, and you can rename it, you can change the extensions. Okay. Now it's a WRL file. And the next thing is, here when I, I open this picture, and I share it, save, and here you see the picture, Here's, it's a PNG file, and now when you press and hold and rename it, you can change it to JPEG. Now it's a JPEG file, or yes, uh, it works for the pictures. Okay, and um, the first one, the WRL file, is now possible um, to WRL to o OBJ. There are online converters. Here you can use um, 
and here you can upload your WRL. It takes a few seconds. And download your object. And now it's possible to drag such files into Procreate uh, into Nomad Sculpt. And yes. And then you have a nice file from a WRL file. That's that's it. <laughs> Have fun with sculpting and painting. Ciao.